Hey guys, welcome to Jurassic Room, and we're going to be doing a video, a live stream tomorrow, around, uh, I don't know, 8 o'clock or something like that. So I'm currently working, hopefully that'll be out tomorrow, so it might be a playlist or whatnot, but it's going to be my favorite videos I've done this year. This year, in total, I've made 326 videos, did y'all know that? But anyway, this is kind of a top five of a couple of things, uh, before, uh, New Year's, which it is... 11:26 my time. Just made some awesome bean dip in my in uh in the living room. It's delicious. About to have some sparkling juice. So figured we get on with first one. My top five most anticipated movies of 2018. Number five. It's kind of a cross between Black Panther and The Predator. Black Panther. I'm confident it's gonna be awesome. Black Panther's been one of my favorite Avengers for the longest time. The Predator, though, is just a little... The story sounds a little off to me, but I'm still optimistic about what it could be. So I'm pretty excited for The Predator. Number four is The Meg, which I just did a video about, with starring Jason Statham. And, of course, that's based on the Steve Alton books, the Steve Alton novels, Meg, about John Megalodon coming up from the Mariana Trench. Number three... Rampage, starring Dwayne Johnson, and that trailer was so awesome. I cannot wait for Rampage. Let me get to see George, the albino gorilla, Ralph, the giant werewolf mutant, and Lizzie, the giant crocodile caprasuchus monster. Number two, Avengers Infinity War. I mean, who is who would not have this on their list? This is going to be... I think it's going to outweigh any Star Wars movie. Uh, I think it's going to beat Last Jedi. I think it's going to just beat expecta ex expectations all around. I mean, you got the biggest cast of celebrities, what I would think, and uh, ca uh, comic characters in history coming together. Me especially, I cannot wait to see Thanos collect all the Infinity Stones. Or at least whatever he's going to do. Number one, y'all can probably guess, is Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. This movie, of course, it looks better than Jurassic World to me. Carnotaurus is in it. Baryonyx is in it. It's gonna, it looks awesome. An extinction level event on Isla Nublar is going to be awesome. And that's why it is number one. And of course, I'll be talking about this again tomorrow on the live stream. We'll be going over it so y'all can watch this if you want. And I'm going to be doing a video soon, too, about NECA, because there's some news from NECA. They are working on a new Pennywise figure from 2017. These are coming out in 2018. They're working on a new Kenner tribute of the uh, purple Xenomorph. And they're also working on what I would assume would be the uh, Dark Horse Comics look back, similar to how the uh, Gorilla Alien down here is. And it's going to be the Scorpion Alien, and that thing looks sick, from what I can tell. So, let me see here. Got a few other things. What were my favorite videos to come out this year? Oh, wait a second. Also, I'm going to be doing another video based on some figures I just learned about called Rep uh, Creature Replica. And they're about cryptids. Uh, and it's a toy line based on cryptid stories. Uh, that, and hopefully, some more are going to come out soon, which I'll be trying to cover. I just heard about them, and they are truly amazing looking toys. So, let's see here. I know I got somewhere. Oh, I must have taken it off, that page. I must have taken it off. Anyway, one of my top favorite videos from this year. I have to say, if I put them into a category of six, it was when we rescued that red-tailed hawk after we got done loading some brick. We found that red-tailed hawk in the yard. That'd be number six. Number five's got to be when we went to uh, Jackson Blue Springs. Got that awesome underwater footage, and links will be in the description below. Had that awesome underwater footage of all those uh, those fish. Number four has got to be when we met Mountain Man again. That was pretty fun. Number three has got to be when we went to. Uh, Ponce de Leon, we saw that big turtle. As you know, I'm trying to remember. I also like the fact that I found some really cool comics this year. I gotta go in, I'm gonna go in there and do this in just a minute, y'all. Also, got this. 
Can't think of anything else. Hold on. Yeah. So there's that. What be uh? And I'll go. I'll, I'll get find number one in just a second. What would be my favorite videos from this year? And I gotta say, the best videos I think I've done. I, I'm gonna go in here and find these real quick. Here's Lisa Found. Six is Ponce de Leon. Five was when we went to the flea market and got, found those awesome comics. Godzilla, Namor, Fantastic Four, and the Lost World Jurassic Park, and that crossover between Man Thing and Spider Man. Four was the Christmas this year. This is a fun Christmas. That was a cool video. Ears bent back like a little pit bull. This? Yeah. You're the mother. Jolene. Yeah, this is the bean dip I made. Alright. No, Three. Oh, it's not a recipe, Keaton. Three was when we saw Kong Skull in the theater. That was fun. Two, Jackson Blue Springs was on here. Yeah, that was fun. The underwater footage, and then of course, Pond Still Yawn. Then number one, which was on the list, was when we went to the beach. We saw all the cool fish, the starfish, the jellyfish, and all that. I'm not talking to you. And let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, my seven. And it's going to be a little odd list right there. Seven of my favorite videos I've done this year. Number seven is the hawk video I said. Number six is the marbled salamander unboxing video I did. That was fun. Number five is the fishing video I did. Which will link in the description. It was a compilation from 2016 through 2017 of all the fishing we did. So check out that video down below. That's a really fun video I, I had a lot of fun making. Number four is the It reaction. Which it, the It reaction trailer one has the most views out of any of our other videos. 59,000. The first time I watched that thing, it freaked me out. First it. I'm going to buy that NECA figure. Number four is Infinity War. Yeah. Infinity War has, I believe... I believe it has uh, 30... No, 39... Yeah, 39,000. Well, that was... Well, you can have it, I guess. And then... Uh, Jurassic The second... My fa second favorite video I did was the Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom official trailer reaction. That video, I believe, has 29,000 views. Yeah. My, my number one favorite, link in the description, was the Jurassic World Evolution trailer. Because I, even though I hyped out more for Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom, Jurassic World Evolution is just one that I hyped out for because we never expected it came out of the blue. We never expected getting another j -Pod game. And I was so excited to actually... I'm so excited to have a PS4 now too, to actually get this game. Good. Cannot wait to play it. Wait, that's uh, good. No, okay. That's it, I think. Can't think of anything else. Let's see, what was the coolest purchases we've done this year? Coolest things we've done? I have to say, getting all those Netflix figures, the uh, Marvel Netflix way figures, was a steal. Paid what, 77 all together for all those figures? And. That was pretty much a steal to build Man Thing. All those comic books at the flea market, that was cool. You know, all those comics, the Chewy, the Toxin figure. Uh, the Marvel Salamander is another really awesome purchase. And then, of course, some of the NECA figures I did get, I think, this year got Serpent Hunter and the Gorilla Alien. Oh, and the... We did get, I did get all my NECA figures this year. The clan leader and uh, the deluxe city hunter. I got all this year, so I was really cool to get all those figures. Um, I'm trying to think of anything else that cool that happened this year. It is 11:37 my time, and we're not going to do a live stream. 
today. We're going to do that tomorrow, of course. That's going to be fun. New Year's Day, first day of 2018, live stream. So, I'll turn it back on just a second when the paw drops. I'm going to drink some sparkling juice and uh, eat some more of my bean dip. Wait, you leave Figueroa. So, I guess that's a total of my favorite experiences this year, my favorite videos you made this year. And let's see. I guess cool things we've done this year, that's about it. So check out all the links in the description of all the videos, and I believe I'm going to hook up another playlist for y'all to check out, which will be the highlight videos of this year, the ones that are my favorites. Ooh, my little man. I guess figure should do this too. Although I've not seen Thor Ragnarok, Justice League, The Last Jedi, or Jumanji, which I'm meaning to see next month in January. I have not seen those yet. These are the 17 movies that I have seen in 2017, ironically. Number one was Kong Skull Island. That was on January or Oh, sorry. March 12th, 2017. And I gave that a 9.5 out of 10. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, which was on May 10th, 2017, which I gave an 8 out of 10. Number 3 is Alien Covenant, which I saw on May 30th, 2017, which I gave a 7 out of 10. Pirates of the Caribbean, The Mentano Tales is number four. I saw that on June 3rd, 2017. I gave that an eight out of 10. Beauty and the Beast, which I saw on June 20th, 2017, which I gave an eight out of 10. Logan, which I saw on June 20th, 2017, which I gave a nine and a half out of 10. John Wick Chapter Two, number, at number seven, at June 21st, 2017. And I gave that a 10 out of 10, which it deserves it. Wonder Woman at number 8 on September 27, 2017. And I gave that an 8 out of 10. Transformers Last Night at 9 on 9, 27, 17. I gave that an 8 out of 10. Personally, it's my favorite Transformers movie. And number 10 is Spider-Man Homecoming at October... Wait... Yeah, October 23rd, 2017, I gave that a 9 out of 10. The Mummy at number 11, I gave, that was at 10, 23, 17. I gave that a 7 out of 10, same as Alien Covenant. It's weird, I like The Mummy, but yet, so bad. Yeah. Number 12, Baby Driver, I gave that a 10 out of 10, and I saw that on October 23rd, 2017. Number 13, 47 meters down. I saw that at 10, 23, 17, and I gave that an 8.5 out of 10. Number 14, War for the Planet of the Apes, on November 9, 2017, I gave that a 10 out of 10. Number 15, The Emoji Movie, at uh, November 9, 2017, which I gave a 2 out of 10. Number 16, The Dark Tower, I saw that on 11, 11 9, 17 again. I gave that an 8 out of 10. And the last one, which was Annabelle Creation at 17. Uh, November 9th, 2017, I gave that a 7.5 out of 10. So those are all the movies. I have to say, if I had to choose my top 5 that I've seen in 2017, and not the ones that are in 2017, which I'll do next month when I see the rest of those movies, I have to do... Hold on. Mm, it's really difficult. Number 1 is Kong Skull Island. Number 2, I gotta give it to uh, Logan. Because it's such a good movie. Number three, I gotta give it to John Wick, Chapter Two. Number four, uh, man, I love Baby Driver, but I think Spider-Man: Homecoming really hit home for me. Number five, which is a really hard toss-up, but I've got to give it to uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two. I just love that movie. I loved Ego in it. I thought he was a cool villain. But I mean, honorable mentions have got to be War for the Planet of the Apes, Baby Driver. 
Transformers The Last Night, Wonder Woman, and Beauty and the Beast. Because I enjoyed Beauty and the Beast more than I thought it would. I thought it was a really good movie. Because I looked at it more as a musical than a movie, which uh, made me enjoy it a little more. So I think that's it, guys. Because the ball's about to drop in a few minutes, and it'll be officially 2018. Nine minutes, actually, so we'll start to wait. We'll have to figure. We got to throw in... I gotta throw in my worst moment for 2017. Mm. It's hard to choose. Cause I didn't really have a lot of bad moments in 2017. Mm. I think the worst thing was when I had my teeth done and I had to go through some of those horrible nerve pain. That was some bad nerve pain, man. It hurt real bad. That's gotta be the, the biggest downside to this year. Was that at that point? See, not much else is really bad has happened. I can't really think of anything else. Was that nerve pain when I was doing my teeth? So that's gotta be it. Oh, actually, uh, probably when we lost a few of our good friends, uh, some of the turtles, the leopard geckos. Um, Toothless and Spud. That was probably the second worst moment of 2017 for me. All right, Katie, turn it up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Voila. Welcome 2018, the year of Infinity War, Rampage, and Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. This is going to be a good year. Happy New Year, little dude. I still I'll spoil it, y'all. Good night. What's y'all's favorite video from the channel from this year? And hit in the comment section below. Let's hit that 1,200 subscriber mark. Well, I should get going. <laughs>